sharks that you see is the sand tiger shark. These sharks are 10 feet long and weigh over 250 pounds. They are found worldwide and are identifiable by their numerous rows of shark teeth. There are several species of sharks that are smaller, yet every bit is dangerous. The Pacific white tip shark is easily identifiable by the white tip on the dorsal fin. They are very aggressive and hunt in packs along reefs at night. They can reach six feet in length. The most numerous sharks in our exhibit are brown sharks, which are frequently found off the coast of Galveston. The brown sharks that you see here are approximately five to seven feet in length and are the most aggressive feeders in the exhibit. It is a common misconception that sharks need to constantly move. However, you may notice several sharks resting on the bottom of the exhibit. They are nurse sharks and the beautifully marked Australian zebra shark, both of which spend the majority of their time on the ocean floor. They can reach up to 10 feet in length and weigh over 200 pounds. The most unusual and rare animal located in the tank above you is the sawfish. It is a ray, not a shark, and can reach over 20 feet in length, yeah, weighing over 350 it. pounds. Right the there. sawfish right there. uses its teeth saw look. to oh, kill wow, its prey. Yeah. It is now considered endangered internationally. No, it's right and there, back there, look. Is proud to be working on partnerships oh, with Australian awesome. scientists to help save the sawfish. Animals in the exhibit are fed three to four times a week. Divers routinely go into the tank for maintenance, but we never feed our sharks while divers are in the water. It would be far too dangerous. Even with the chainmail suits our divers wear, the brown and sand tiger sharks have enough power in their jaws to crush a person's arm or leg. In recent years, there has been a decrease in the shark population OSEARCH, a nonprofit organization, is leading the way in groundbreaking research about the biology and health of sharks through tagging, biosampling, and data collected from their global shark tracker. You can track great whites online. It's pretty cool. Landry's Incorporated has partnered with OSEARCH to share this valuable research through our development of classroom curriculum. We hope that you've enjoyed our brief look into the exciting world of sharks. We'll continue on from here. Sharks are fascinating animals. It is amazing how adaptive they are. Have any of you heard about the great white shark that escaped from our shark tank during the last flood? Our scientific staff has searched the entire Gulf of Mexico trying to recapture it. It was never found, and some believe that it may still be in the Buffalo Bayou. So keep a lookout as we travel through the park. The downtown aquarium project was conceived